Hello everyone, so we've seen the Cope Cage, Cope Tires, the Cope Woolly Mammoth, and now the Cope Pig Pen. Here's a video of this monstrosity. Now, I'm no tank expert, and after seeing this, I think we can say neither of the Russians. Because isn't this just going to stop the turret from being able to rotate, and then stop it from being able to operate as a tank? They've basically turned it from a tank into something like a Stug Tank Destroyer. They've also decided to fit a bathtub upside down on the front and back for some reason. Now we may laugh at this, and will laugh at this of course, but I wonder if there's actually a reason for this. So, if the reason may be to actually not use this as a tank, but as a type of makeshift APC. So, we often see Russian troops riding on the tops of vehicles, usually BMPs and other variants, but we have seen them on top of tanks as well which is done because it's safer on top if a vehicle gets hit by a mine or gets hit by a missile. And we've also seen many vehicles of drones flying into those troops mounted on top, so it's still not a safe place to be. So is there a method to the madness here, and this is an attempt to turn the tank into a modified APC for troops to dismount from. So soldiers sit underneath a pig pen to protect them from drones, the tank rolls quickly into an area and the troops dismount, the tank then pulls back. This is the same tactic we've seen being used with those death trap golf buggies which have been cropping up on videos this year. They were used to quickly shuttle a number of cannon fodder to a key position, the troops dismount, the golf buggies are either just abandoned there or brought back. With mixed success actually to be fair, it seems to have worked to a degree in some areas to quickly capture a key area, but of course if the desert cross was spotted, the troops stood no chance, so we saw many, many losses using these things. The Desert Crossers were basically the type of vehicle that the private piles of the Russian army get put in. So maybe this is an attempt at similar and actually provide some protection for the troops, just with a tank with a pig pen attached to it instead. If that's the case, I could see it working to a degree. Of course, this tank can no longer function as a tank, as its barrel can no longer rotate. But as a makeshift APC, who knows? I think it would actually protect troops to a degree. But with those gaping entrances at the front of the back, if a drone flew through there to detonate other troops on top, it's going to be absolutely chaos. It's going to turn the tank into a mobile barbecue. So who knows? We are going to have to wait and see if this monstrosity appears on another video. One thing for sure though, the turret toss of this is going to be pretty impressive when it blows through the pig pen and sends that shoot into the heavens as well. So that's it for this video. A short one, but one I hope you found interesting. Thanks very much, and take care everybody.